Beam down smoke. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Nalo and today we're going to be talking about the sticker sale that is upcoming for the Berlin Major 2019 and what you need to invest in. Okay guys, so you've probably noticed that each of these sticker capsules currently cost an obscene amount of money. They cost about $5 per capsule and that is a lot for something like a sticker capsule. You're probably wondering how stuff like the Katowice 2019 stickers are so cheap and uh, these current ones are still so expensive if the sticker capsules are going to remain at this price. Well, that's because usually they don't, and it depends on the major, of course, but for the most part, the majors are going to have sticker sales. Basically, what happens during these sticker sales is all these sticker capsules are really discounted. I think they go down to around the 99 cent range, and so they're pretty cheap. They're, they're you know, you can buy a lot of them and make a lot of profit off of the stickers that you get out of them. Now, when you're investing in sticker capsules or when you're investing in these stickers themselves, you have to take into account a few factors. One of them, obviously, is design. That's probably the most important factor overall. Another one of them is obviously what team is doing the best of the major which one is going to do you know which one is actually going to go and win the major all together that is definitely a huge factor as well and then what teams people have liked for a very long time such as like Navi that's a team that has been around for a very long time and has a ton of fans another factor that you have to take into account though is what the sticker base looks like now a sticker base is essentially what the background of the sticker is so for example in the Katowice 2019 uh, major we had a very basic background it was just a circle and it had a pretty you know crappy hollow effect to be completely honest but the stickers still ended up doing okay like the Furia, Furia Hollow for example and uh, I think the stickers for this current major can do okay as well just depending on uh, you know if people actually end up liking the background or not people seem to be a bit contested on it but for the most part I think people have a generally negative perception of these current stickers however there is still some money to be made so let's talk about it so guys I'm going to give you five of the best stickers that I think you can buy for this current major the reason I chose five is because that is a good range for you to choose from when you're just investing in a specific amount of stickers furthermore I don't think they're gonna cost an obscene amount of money so you could you could you know get a five of these stickers or you know a few of each uh, for around the $20 range and USD of course so let's talk about what five those actually are now the first one that we're going to be talking about and probably the best one that you can invest in is the, going to be the Furia Hollow so the Furia Hollow has also been really good from the Katowice 2019 experiences that we've seen uh, with that specific sticker and I think that this new one can also do really really well in the future the previous one rose all the way up to around the $60 range at one point before dropping back down so I think this current one that we have can also do super super well so make sure you're keeping an eye out for that and if you can invest in the Furia Hollow for the Berlin to 2019 major, then definitely do that. The newer Furia Hollow is not going to hold the same price that the Katowice 2019 one did, but it still will make quite a bit of money over time, and I think it is the most preliminary one that you can actually invest in. So the reasons that this one is good is because obviously it has a very good view by the community. People really seem to like the design of this. It reminds me of the I Buy Power Hollow, of course, and uh, obviously the previous one did super, super well as well. So that means people are looking for another hollow that is going to do just as well as the previous one. And for that, you can definitely look towards this current Furia Hollow to do that same job. All right, guys, moving on to the number four spot, we have the Navi Hollow. So I think this one is always just going to be a very good overall hollow to get. People always know Navi is going to make it to a major. They've pretty much made it to every single major so far. And uh, they are always a team that really does show their skill and does really well at each major. Simple is obviously a god at the game and I don't think we're going to see anybody that is as technically skilled as him ever again. So I think with that kind of security the Navi Hollow is obviously going to be a very good one to invest in. Uh, furthermore I think the Hollow on the Navi sticker actually doesn't look that bad. Uh, the Navi Hollow actually it, it's not you know a very bright one but you can still see the hollow effect and I think it doesn't look that bad at all so that one definitely is a good choice to invest in. The number three spot is going to go to the Dream Eaters Hollow. I, this is one that I was personally really excited for and personally the background doesn't look all that great of course for the Berlin Major 2019 however I think the Dream Eaters Hollow does still look pretty good and the Dream Eaters obviously have a really awesome logo. This is one that a lot of people anticipated to be a really good sticker uh, regardless of the background obviously when it was leaked or when it was shown I guess at the first time and uh, I think that does kind of live up to the hype. I think it does look very, very nice. So definitely try to pick a few of these up during the sticker sale. There's not much more to say about the Dream Eaters Hollow. It just looks really good and they have a really good logo. And it's one of those, you know, off ones where they probably won't see another major, sort of like Flash Gaming. And, uh, you know, it can make you a lot of money because of that, because of the rarity at least. All right, guys, moving on to the number two spot, we have what I like to call the big 
maybe money maker. So this one's kind of in a complete middle. I don't know if it's going to do really well. I don't know if it's going to do really bad. Uh, it all depends obviously on the final, but this is going to go to the ends hollow. So the ends hollows are going to look generally bad in general, just because ends has a brown uh, logo. The, the logo is just not one that works really well with the hollow designs that CSGO puts out. Uh, but I do think that the ends hollow can still do really, really well if ends does really, really well in the tournament. Uh, if you look at the signatures for each of the ends players from the previous major, they all hold a lot higher prices than their counterparts because, you know, ends was such a huge deal at the Katowice 2019 major. And if they win this one as well, it can do really, really well as a sticker. So I think the ends one is something that you can definitely look at. If they do end up winning this major, which, I mean, there is a possibility, of course, they are currently, uh, at the time of this making this video, on track to do so. And uh, I think that they can, you know, make a decent sticker and make you a bit of money uh, in that process. And finally, guys, the last hollow that we're going to talk about is the Tai Lu hollow. This is always going to be one that's just a very safe investment. The Tai Lu hollow, obviously, is going to be supported by Chinese uh, buyers, and there's a lot of them in the CSGO market. And with that being said, obviously the Tai Lu Hollow is going to do incredible things for your wallet. It's going to make you a ton of money just because every single Tai Lu Hollow ever has always done that. So if you can get your hands on one of these for a very low price, I do highly suggest it. It's one of the safest ones that you can invest in for sure. That's why I kind of left it at the end of the video because it's always going to be a very safe one. There's always going to be Chinese investors going for the Tai Lu Hollow. There weren't any other Chinese teams that showed uh, really good standings at this major. So I think that the Tai Lu Hollow kind of stands on its own there. And obviously they didn't do great at this major, but it doesn't really matter. Tyloo never really does all that amazing at majors, but their sticker still ends up being super expensive thanks to the Chinese investors. So this is a really nice uh, sticker for you to buy at any major, and it's definitely going to be a good one for this major as well. And with that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was a little bit of a shorter one, just hopefully it does kind of introduce you to the upcoming sticker sale if there is one, and uh, hopefully it does guide you on the path to making a bunch of money at this Berlin 2019 major in terms of stickers at least. Obviously, if you didn't do so great on the souvenir package, then you can obviously make a lot of money off of these uh, stickers as well. So hopefully this was an informative video for you guys, and if you did enjoy it and if it did help you decide on what stickers to invest in, be sure to subscribe to my channel and help me get to that 500 mark, of course, and then also be sure to like this video if it was informative, and uh, consider commenting down below any critiques that you have for me and what I can improve for the next video. So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you all next time. Don't forget to join my Discord server. Peace.